The music of this game is not that bad. Now I can't promise you this I have voice in every vet. Can you load any slower? Oh my god, credits. <laughs> I'm already getting lazy with the editing. Hello, and welcome to the Paint Gun Testing Initiative. You have been in hibernation for... Nine, 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 nine... Uh, that doesn't seem right. Well, it doesn't really matter. Please leave the restroom whenever you are ready. I know that bed might look comfy. Yes, it sure does. <laughs> but we've got... much to do, so please exit your room. You know, I don't even know why they even bother giving you a bed. They will drag the test subjects into the stasis chambers anyways. Can somebody tell me on what this guy is yapping about? After long periods of hibernation, the human body loses some of its strength. So, before we get to the paint gun testing, we should do some warm-up tests. Testing hasn't officially begun yet, so we're free to talk without anyone listening in on us. But your profile says you're not an early bird, so I understand if you don't want to talk at the moment. I really don't. Dang, this floor is weak. Oh, I can't get in there. I was just informed that even if we are not testing yet, I am not allowed to mention anything that is mentioned in your profile. Good. Ouch. Yes, I know this experiment will go without any problems. I'll Continue. stop. Pick up the device and let the vacuum delivery system take us to the first test involving paint. Okay, I know you're wondering what you are holding. Don't worry, it'll all make sense as we progress. Um, hmm, let me see... There. Okay, just go through the door now. Oh, Here we go. Why don't you try firing your gun? See what happens. You solved that really fast. Now, that level was idiot proof. A challenge for us. How to take that test? Whoopsie daisies. Well, very good. Nice. Okay. Can't wait to see Gabe's and Braden's reaction to Gary Gary. Your testing associate for this testing track. Glad to meet you. Um, test subject name here. Hmm. Guess you're Stop yapping and let me in. In what case you noticed yet, that green field, the Aperture Science Paint Gun Activation Field, also known as Fizzler, blocking and deactivate your paint. I would have added goofy audio here. But CapCut doesn't have any good sound effects. It's literally Roblox.
realize that painting is all good and fun, but cleaning that stuff up is horribly expensive. So just please only spray where you think is necessary. Our Aperture Science sentient washing servos will thank you. Now this is the Advanced Jumping Training Course. It will teach you, ideally, how to navigate through future test chambers. I guess half this fit isn't goofy editing but just a walkthrough. Final jump. Looks really fun. Sometimes I wish I had legs so I could do what you do, but then I remember the other things we do to test subjects. I uh, probably shouldn't have said that. Don't worry, I'm sure you'll be fine. This. I just looked at the documentation for these big monitors. Let me show you myself. Sweet, isn't it? Now you can look at me. So it's not as creepy knowing you're being watched, cause you can watch me too. How cool is that? Oh, the door. Let me get that for you. And the song. Good luck. Nothing happened, guys. Once again, nothing happened.
Now this is where the fun begins. A real puzzle. You will have to use all the skills you've learned in the previous chambers. Let me put some ambient music on to get us in a good puzzle-solving mood. Good luck. I'll stop yapping from now on because, one, I'm lazy and two, I'm probably being very annoying right now. It turns out that the vacuum tube I gave you for the previous test does not connect to the next test chamber. So we are going to have to walk for a little bit. This test chamber was for another test, which we are not assigned to. It was supposed to be solved with a portal gun. Wicked stuff. I'm sure there's a way we can solve it in our way. This test was copied from Portal 1 to 2 then to this game. Nicely done! I couldn't have done it better myself. Now, we have to find a vacuum delivery system to get you to- This elevator is malfunctioning. We are looking for a vacuum delivery system. The doors look to open when the subject walks through the corridor. I should have probably prevented that from happening.
Just jump in it and we'll be on our way. This test does make use of portals as a testing element. If you've never bumped into them before, they're pretty straightforward. Thingy goes in, thingy goes out. are a piece of cake, nothing out of this world. It's time to increase the complexity just by one variable. New chapter, yes. Time to cap it off here.